Hello again, my friends, and welcome back to my Terraria playthrough, episode 29. Today's episode, we're going to be kind of diving a little bit more into hard mode, hopefully finding more of the materials that we need, um, including cobalt, mithril, and titanium, um, and possibly more if we can uh, manage to get that done. If that sounds like something that you will enjoy, feel free to like this video, and also subscribe to see some more Terraria content. So actually, I was just going to kind of um, hang out and um, do some quick stuff before um, before recording. And then I saw in our tunnel here that we actually got some cobalt right next to right next to our spawn, uh, right next to our base. And it's actually a decent amount of it as well. So I figured I would uh, come and grab this real quick. Um, so it's kind of good to know that this level is where cobalt is found. Um, I am kind of stunned at how much is here, to be honest. Um, we're going to actually want to turn this cobalt into a pickaxe. Um, I don't know how much we need to make that pickaxe, but let's go ahead and go up and see. We'll make this into a bar. I don't know if this is going to be quite enough. This is going to make us 13 bars. And look at, we ha already have, look at cobalt chainsaws. I think we may be able to already make um, a cobalt pickaxe, which would be perfect. So I now have some boreal wood here. Let's see if we have enough. We can make a pickaxe. I think we are also able to make, oh, maybe not. Um, so I'm going to have to look up the recipe for a pickaxe because it could even be like 15. It could be very close to that. So let's see if we could find that really quickly. Um, and then I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I did check and it seems as though that we need 15 uh, cobalt. So we got so close to getting one right away. Uh, but we are going to need 15 cobalt bars. We have two cobalt there um, that's just gonna mean that we need to find five more cobalt ore which honestly now I was I was kind of worried about making that happen but I'm not worried about that at all anymore I kind of feel like we can make that happen pretty quickly so we're gonna kind of dive into this little area I see a wraith coming oh he got scared Did you see that he kind of ran away um, so my concerns um, are that our our um, armor is not good enough um, so I w I'm going to want to spend some time finding better armor um, I also think that we got this shotgun and I love it I am genuinely very happy with this shotgun but that being said I saw on the wiki that there is an upgrade um, that can be made which is a I believe it was um, the Onyx Blaster, and I definitely want that. I, I want to upgrade this. Look at a gelatin crystal, which I believe a gelatin crystal allows us to spawn the Queen Slime, which gives us some pretty cool loot. So that's actually really good that we found that so quickly. Um, so this episode is really going to be focused mainly around getting um, materials and progressing through the early stages of hard mode. Um, it will definitely be more structured than last episode was because I know I did not do a great job of staying on task. But that being said, I'm perfectly content with how uh, yesterday's episode came out and I do think that it's perfectly fine let's kind of sorry focusing on killing these guys this is my first time seeing these illuminate uh, is it illuminati slime that's what i thought it said illuminant slime and i keep missing it because it keeps hopping around okay i see an angler fish must be a stronger version of the uh piranha so we're going to definitely attempt to get enough materials to kind of, oh, we definitely, that angler fish hits hard. 
So I think that, there we go. We're able to find our souls of light here. Um, I was really appreciative of the comments in the last episode. I think you guys could tell how kind of uh, worried I was of hard mode starting. Uh, and so Golden Strawberry left a great comment about um, about the souls of light, which kind of explained to me where everything is because there's so many different new items that we're going to need. Um, I should say more crafting material, even more so than items, a little bit more specific than that. Um, this will be a nice little amount of guys to kill here. Oh, let's not fall in there. We definitely want to heal. Taking some serious damage over there. So if we're lucky enough, we're going to survive by heading back to the house because I realized how low my health was. So we did get a soul of light. That is, I believe, if I remember correctly, you, f you find those in the underground hollow. Uh, when you fight enemies there, they'll give you that. Uh, so that's one, that's one way to get those. We also need souls of... Um, oh, souls of fright, souls of light, souls of might, they're all like, they all rhyme. I, I believe that that's the, that's kind of the, the um, pattern that they have, so to speak. Um, and so let's kind of, let's hang out over here. I'm a little bit worried about um, our health here is very, very low. What I'm going to do is pop over to the nurse and get her to heal me real quick. Oh my goodness. Look at the amount of gold that costs for her to heal me. I don't. I think we'll be okay. I don't think we need to heal that bad. Uh, what we'll do is we'll head back. Oh, look at that map is updated with the hollow. This area between is very interesting. So I wonder, are we able to see... Oh, look at There's a gold chest there, which we already knew that one torch torch so you can see a little bit here now are we able to find like the the new ores can we find that by looking around here i really doubt it that would be a bit on the overpowered side i almost feel like this would be a good area to explore oh well look at this crimtain is here so there is a chance i guess that we would be able to find some of our newer but we may have to see it first. So that's the that's the big thing. Is that we may have to see it before we're actually able to find the different ores. So it's gonna be it's gonna be um, a learning process for sure. So oh that actually we're we're back up. We're we have healed all the way. Thank goodness we did not pay to get that done, because that would have been a waste of money for sure. Um, let's see, where do we want to go? Oh, I had an idea actually. We want to find, we want to find this material. We want to find enough of what we need. Oh, look it. Bada bing, bada boom. I think that's some cobalt right there. Yes, it is. And that means that we have enough to make a cobalt pick. So I don't know what the difference is as well between a cobalt pickaxe and a cobalt drill. I know that you can get either of those things. I did get at least that far into hard mode when I played before. Um, I don't know if there's a difference between them. Maybe if we maybe if we get over here we'll be able to see if there is a difference there. But cobalt, so now we have 19 cobalt. We're gonna come over here and now we have cobalt drill, cobalt pickaxe. So the range is lower, but this is faster, and it looks like they do the same amount of damage. So maybe the only difference is the range. If that's the only difference, I'd rather go with the faster one, because we don't really use the pickaxe for much in the first place, um, other than mining. And range is not really an issue at the moment. Oh, so now look at that mining speed. That is pretty impressive. So I'm happy with that. That was a, I think that was a good get. 
Um, so we need mithril as well. We also need... We need to find pretty much everything. <laughs> we pretty much need uh, every bit of items we can get. And so I do know we need... Um, mithril next and we need mithril because we need to upgrade our anvil to a mithril anvil which is going to allow us to craft um better items in the first place um and so let's see here what i would like to do is figure out what in the world we're doing first of all that'd be a great idea Oh, I kind of want to try that, but I'm worried that because of our defense, she's going to kind of destroy us. Um, so let's see. What I would like to do is probably just go hunting for more materials. I don't really see what else we need to do down here, but what I'll do is clear out my inventory a bit. Oh, you know, so I was looking into... Um, I remember talking to you guys about the... Um, the items that was, oh goodness, it slipped my mind. Oh, the cell phone, the cell phone. So the big thing about the cell phone is that we need a bunch of items just like this. So a metal detector. Um, we also need like the compass and so compass, depth meter, but we need items like these. And this is going to give us access to the cell phone. So what I had the idea of is I think I'm going to go through all my items and kind of find each of these and put them into its own chest. And then hopefully we have enough to uh, make at least some of the parts um, that we can keep with us so that we get that information. Because I do think that this will help in finding the hard mode items. So I'm going to look through my inventory and figure out what we have and what we don't have, what we need, um, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so at the moment, all we have available to craft for us is the GPS, which we're going to make now. Um, we're missing the uh, radar for the tally counter and the life form analyzer to make what's called a wreck. And then Goblin Tech, we're missing a DPS meter and a stopwatch um, to go along with this metal detector. And then we're missing a bunch of stuff from the fish, the fisherman or the angler. Um, and so what we're going to do is I'm actually going to keep these on me. I don't really need the tally counter as much, but oh, I didn't check in here actually. I don't. I think I forgot to check this one. I don't believe that we have it. So I actually bought the DPS meter from the from the traveling merchant already but what ended up happening was that was when my game kept crashing and so i must have lost that um that item in that process and he never came back so i was not able to repurchase that um, but we know now that if we see a stopwatch or a dps meter we need to buy those those are like that's necessary for us to buy uh, I'm kind of thinking we might jump into this crimson because I know this goes down pretty far and maybe we could find some more cobalt or mithril down here. Could definitely... Oh, I see. Look at platinum detected, lead detected. So this helps that we brought some of these items along with us. Blood crawlers nearby somewhat. Cobalt's detected nearby. So the question... Oh, look at... Did you see that Mithril is detected nearby as well? So I'm a bit closer to the Cobalt now than I am to the Mithril. Oh, look at... We don't want to get stuck by these guys because we know how much they hurt. Oh. I say don't get stuck by him and then I get stuck by him. So... That's how that works. <laughs> Um, let's see, so we don't want to get stuck or trapped by these guys at all. We want to make sure we kill that guy. But where is this guy taking us? That's the question. So this blue fairy is taking us somewhere. Let's figure out where. So this is so much easier to do now. I'm hoping he takes us to some cobalt. Would be very nice. Maybe even some mithril would be good. 
I don't know if he takes us to ores or if it's only chests or whatever that they might take us to, but we're going to figure that out. Um, I think with this drill, it makes quite a bit of noise. I may have to turn down the recording really quickly. Let's do that real quick. Game's going to go away. Hopefully that's a little bit better on the ears. We'll get a little bit of lag while we're waiting for it to finish. Oh, okay. So we got a strange plant. Apparently that... Apparently that was enough for the the blue fairy to carry us. Um, well, you know what? That works for me. I'm not too upset about it. I don't know what we got. Oh, I was like, I don't know what we got attacked by. Something that's doing quite a bit of damage to us, though. Get rid of him there. So cobalt is detected nearby. I wish they gave us an idea of where. That would be very nice. I think it's got to be in this direction over here somewhere. But I don't want to risk it too much. We're going to kind of go around and if we see it, we see it, you know. There's something there. I don't know if this is a rare ore or if that's just normal. That's just silver. Cobalt still says it's nearby over here somewhere. So let's keep looking. It could even be good just to get some cobalt armor now while we... Oh, I don't know what that was. What is that? Just copper? It looked weird. The color of it looked very strange. So it says that there's mithril nearby. See, I'm, I'm getting kind of, I'm getting a bit lost just trying to follow that. That's why I didn't want to follow it too much. We do quite a bit of damage. Oh, look at the wizard. I know we're going to need some of this stuff eventually. I know we're going to need the crystal ball. I saw something. That had to do with the crystal ball. I don't remember. I think it was the um, infinite mus uh, musket balls. That would be super useful for us. Also, it, are the caves more dangerous now? Or the spider caves, I should say. Not just caves in, in general, but... Kind of. So this was, I guess, the struggle with... With us uh, getting rid of that pickaxe. That pickaxe is due to a really good job of clearing up these cobwebs. So I should have like looked up real quick what um, mithril looks like. What cobalt looks like. The cobalt's blue. It's always blue. I remembered that one. But when it comes to the other ones, honestly, I do not know. What is... There was a pressure plate there, and I have no idea what that was what that was for. You know what we should have done? <laughs> I forgot all about that. Why would we not use spelunker potions? I remember getting a bunch of it. So here's some silver. Okay, now if we see something on here, it says chest detected nearby, which I don't know. Does that tell you about chests that you have already found? I don't, I'm not sure about that one. But we picked up that chest. This is platinum, nothing special. Sorry for the light. I'm just kind of going based on the direction we're going. I don't even, I couldn't even see either. I'm just kind of making our way down. I'm seeing big things of ore and I'm like, let's just check it, see what it is. So that was just silver, nothing, nothing too extravagant. We got quite a few bad guys over here. Let's protect ourselves. We got skeleton archers here. Did 
don't know what that is over there. What do we got around this area? Life crystal detected nearby. I guess that's cool. It's not necessarily anything we need right now. I want to see what this, what that is, because obviously it's something. Orange blood root. What in the world is this? Whoa! Oh, we missed this guy. The blood jelly. Now that's crazy because I guess they don't glow like the normal ones do. Uh, and so I didn't even see them, to be honest. That is not good. So we have to be more mindful of our health uh, than we've been because we're really struggling. I don't know why I jumped down this hole either. Um, oh, look it. Cobalt. <laughs> so that's good. This is something at least. Add that to our list. Is this anything special? Is that... Nope, it's just platinum. Nothing special, unfortunately. Uh, do we need to use another Spelunker potion? It seems as though we do. I see a bunch of ore here. I don't know what mithril looks like. I should probably go through and look up a picture of it just to figure out what it looks like. That's just copper. Could be that one, but I think that's copper as well. I wish um, the different rarities gl glue, glue, gl glowed, <laughs> glue or glowed, I guess, in different colors so that it was a little easier. I already have a hard enough time seeing some colors as it is. Um, this makes it darn near impossible for me to tell which is what. It's still saying mithril's detected nearby. Let's get that bat before he gets us. Is this it? Maybe. Oh, yes, here it is. Mithril ore acquired. 13 of it there. So it says a chest is detected nearby. That's probably... Well, I see the anglerfish coming at us. Okay, we got him. Oh, what a shot. That guy got me on the run. Okay, a chest is detected. Is it just this one that's down here? That's my question. Oh, this looks unnatural. Is that something like that does not look like something that would have happened uh, naturally, but it definitely could be. Don't get me wrong. Silver lead. Nope, it's natural. It's just me being a doofus, I guess. So I'm going to make my way. I see this chest over here and I have a, f I would think that we would have already gotten it because it's pretty apparent, but I don't see an obvious way to it. So yeah, we did not get it already. Um, another Spelunker potion, always welcome. We don't need recall potions. We'll take the silver bars. Okay. So what I'm going to do is pause the recording. I'm going to look for more materials and I'll, I'll pop back in with you guys whenever I find something new. All right, guys, so I've been adventuring for a bit. I found quite a bit of cobalt, um, like 130-ish um, cobalt ore, which is, I don't think that's too bad. And I feel like I'm pretty well versed in finding it when I'm using the Spelunker potion now as well, um, which is definitely a huge benefit. Um, now the problem I'm having is with Mithril, I really do not know how to differentiate it between the other ones. Um, I don't know if there's any si sort of hint um, that I can use. Look at this. Two chests. Oh, some sort of temple? Ooh, I don't know what this is. I see a giant turtle. Very cool. Flippers. Wow. Definitely not anything that we need. Night Owl Potion. We'll actually take one of those. That'd be very nice. Oh, this is what we'll do here. I see that guy coming. Oh, 
What is this here? Just amethyst. Nothing too special. Now is this... Are these bricks? Oh, you know, this is probably the dungeon. This is probably the dungeon. I remember there being a part of the dungeon that went under into... I don't know how tough this guy is. He's got 400 health, so that's pretty strong. Let's try to keep him down here. Cool, we kind of stun locked him, so I feel a little bit bad for cheating the system a bit, but... You know, we gotta do what we gotta do to survive at this point. So there is mithril nearby, from what it says. Is this the mithril? I have a feeling it's not. My feeling was correct. So let's see, we don't want to get ourselves killed. I don't know, like I said, I do not know what I'm looking for when it comes to mithril. I don't know what differentiates it from the other ones because I really haven't gotten a good look at it yet. Um, so it looks like we're getting farther away from it or at least something else is taking over in terms of the detection. Oh, this is kind of a cool little enemy, but I bet you he hurts. So let's get rid of him <laughs> while we have the chance. A wall creeper. Okay, stronger spider. So there are stronger spiders. I don't know. Oh, look at here's some mithril. So does it shine a little bit greener? Not entirely sure, but it's definitely less prevalent um, than cobalt, for sure. Um, a chest detected nearby, it's probably the one back there. Um, we are going to hop back to the house. We've gotten so much stuff. Um, I've zoomed out, as you guys can probably see, because I was trying to see more of the screen. But And I've zoomed this in, because I was hoping to be able to uh, to mouse over and see um, the items that are there. But that is not the case. I was not allowed to do that. Um, and so, that's a bit unfortunate. Um, so, oh, I need to clean out this inventory. So, that is definitely something I'll do on camera before the next episode. Um, we've got some mithril. Okay, we got four mithril. Is that nowhere? I'm sure that's nowhere near enough to make a cobalt or a mithril anvil. Uh, I'm not even entirely sure how much I needed for the anvil. I forgot to I forgot to look that part up. So let me check real quick. Search for terraria, uh, mithril, anvil. And let's see what we get here. So it takes 10 mithril bars, and we've gotten four. Um, so that's going to be quite the experience trying to find um, enough mithril to make that happen. Um, I want plenty because I, I do want to really focus. Oh, maybe we should make some cobalt armor just because that's going to probably be better than what we have now. We'll check. We'll, we'll definitely we'll look into it. Look, at, we got 42 cobalt out of that. Let's put the rest of that in here. And I promise the next time, next time we run a video, I promise you guys that I'll be, I'll have better... Um, item management so for damage on the mask it's honestly not all that much better it's not better it's not better enough to warrant uh, going out and using it uh, but oh, even that's not that much better oh I have a hard time so fast speed fast speed I have a hard time getting rid of those things for something that's barely better um, what I think we'll do is take a little bit of a gamble. Um, or, no, we won't take a gamble. 
I, I'm not gonna take a gamble. I'm gonna play it a little bit safe. Um, so what I'm going to do is call this video here. I was going to say we could actually try to fight the queen slime, but we're not going to do that yet. Um, what I'm gonna do is in the video here, if you enjoyed the hunt for uh, hard mode, for the hard mode items, whatever you want to call them, hard hard mode resources, remember to leave a like on this video if you're excited to see what what's coming next in hard mode. Feel free to subscribe to the channel. My name is Bubbasaurus, and I've been your host today. And remember to always be on your Bubbasaurus best.